I think that uh, first of all we have to implement the decisions of the 21st of July. Those uh, decisions are about to be approved by uh, almost all parliaments of the uh, Eurozone. That is the most important step. If with some leveraging, which is not our immediate priority, additional force can be given to the FSF, it is something that uh, we would uh, certainly welcome, but it's not absolutely necessary at this uh, point in time. And what form would that take? Could it come from the That is still under consideration. And do you think the FSF is large enough to deal with Italy if necessary? I'm not speculating about any uh, future country. The EFSF is uh, large enough to deal with quite a number of uh, situations. Uh, don't forget that so far the EFSF has uh, dispersed a very, few, a very small amount of um, its uh, lending capacities. So um, uh, therefore there is no immediate need uh, to increase um, uh, the EFSF. It, Moreover, I think that uh, we should not speculate about other countries coming under the umbrella. Uh, what is most important is that all the countries of the Eurozone implement a strict fiscal uh, discipline and thereby preventing uh, a risk from having to uh, borrow money from, from the EFSF. I think that's our top priority. Do you think the ESM should be fast-tracked? I think that would be very difficult because uh, don't forget that uh, the relevant treaty um, uh, probably needs to be um, adapted to take into account all the decisions of the 21st of July and has to be approved by 17 uh, parliaments. So that um, will take some time. So I don't see it um, uh, to be implemented uh, much in advance on the 1st of uh, January 2013. I just have a couple more questions on Daxia yeah. and then we we'll let you go to the meeting. Um, Daxia obviously is also of interest to Luxembourg, so uh, just considering what's going on in the news, can, can they really rule out a capital infusion? Or can you rule out a capital infusion for Daxia? We are following uh, the situation of uh, Daxia closely. I am in uh, permanent contact with um, uh, the board and the um, management of uh, Dexia and um, I can assure you that uh, the governments of the three countries will take whatever steps are necessary to make sure that uh, the clients and the employees of Dexia can have trust um, in the um, in that um, uh, bank as we did in 2008 but um, uh, all options um, of, uh, are on the table in a constructive manner to make sure that um, the bank in, in whole or in parts will remain a very uh, serious um, financial institution. Mm -hmm. Are there any considerations to reintroduce um, government guarantees? on senior, senior debt. It's not the preferred route for the Luxembourg government, but as I said, we will take whatever it takes because it's a systemic bank for Dexia, like for any other bank, so um, uh, to make sure that these banks in an, in an environment which is uh, complicated will uh, remain uh, a trustworthy and stable, a stable bank.